Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Open XCOM The World of Terrifying Silence. When we last left off we have just finished our fight against Lobsterman and not even one day later a lot of USO alien subs appear over here a small one, a large one I think, no two small ones and a large one. And they are most likely going to build another base either infiltration mission or uh, maybe a whatchamacallit base building mission so there's gonna be four five six of them again and we're gonna farm them all i left you with the cliffhanger what happens i did not i was not able to resist and i looked at them fast forward it a little bit it's aquatoids so no need to be worried we can equip our standard stuff this time and just uh, go after them and kill them all. <laughs> Aquatoids do have mind control, but uh, we can handle mind control. That's not such a big deal, I guess. Big deal was handling only melee weapons. That was, uh, that was pretty hard. This will be a piece of cake, a walk in the park. <laughs> anyway, there's another large, see? There will probably be some more. So let's uh, maybe take Triton 1 as well. And now we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 people for 4 USOs. That's okay. Whoever gets there first will have the honor. Looks like Triton 1 will have the honor. On touchdown side 61. You need to come closer now. This guy? No. Triton 5. Ah, this guy. Go here, for example. Triton is ready. Here we go. So, first of all, let's put uh, the weapons on ourselves. Maybe. No, actually, don't. Don't pre prime that. I don't know who gets mind controlled when. So maybe one of these and you guys are fine, you guys are fine. Everything is fine, looks like it. We'll um, end the turn immediately and start looking around ourselves on the second turn as usual. Good. So we are in the corner. That's not the worst. There is nobody in sight. Correct. There is somebody in here. So, you know what? We can totally deal with them. With Pritza. Good job, Pritza. And that's actually a very good position for everybody to disembark. Mm -hmm. We have some cover, but first let's hide behind the craft and just disembark, I would say, like this. And number one, number two, number three, number four. And these guys can just come forward. Okay. Our approach vector will be through these things. Potentially stay hidden, which looks will not be the case anymore because they have spotted us already. But no mind control for some reason. All right, all right, I like no mind control. There's one. How can we deal with this guy? He's uh, pretty hidden. So, how about we throw him some surprise? Not sure, not sure. Deadlock? Yeah, totally enough. Okay. We don't have to hit them exactly. I mean, it's, it's, it's seriously enough to just be close. This guy, look at him, melee aquatoid. OMG. Yeah, that is totally possible. So, dear squid. Thank <laughs> you. 
Really? That missed? Okay. Grace? That's much better. Alright, from this side... Not much cover over there, but this will do. Maybe. And butter... Just go there. Britsa this way. Deadlock this way. Squid will go up on the craft. And now these guys... Mm, sure, just come out. Soul Keeper. Exo number three. Maybe you can just stay here. There. Squid, Jetsam, Jetsam, come here. Sounds like a plan. Next turn. Okay, you're up. Somebody always under molecular control. That's not good. Don't do that, Grace. Alright, so... That happens, eh? Interesting. Interesting. All right, Mr. Squid. That's one. Then who is hurt? You are hurt. You were... Um, okay, dropped. Okay, you can't drop anything. <laughs> right. Well, you know what? We can't have that. Can't have that. I need to stun you or something. And I, but I will need to heal you first. So let's first uh, take this. Jet some. him up that's all right and now you can put that away and maybe stun him not sure if all right maybe maybe what we can do is just go and kill them all before they do any more damage actually so you are under molecular control are you not okay good that you didn't use the drill but only the thermal taser that uh, definitely helped come over here trower and one level up two levels up all right and now this guy may be still under molecular control let's go and hide and also shoot wherever we can 57 from here please that was not that great squid can't shoot anymore just oops actually not there come back you can't shoot you are too far i think pritza so we might have a slight problem here what shall we do? What shall we do? Hmm. I mean, you could theoretically shoot over there. So Deadlock can't, Squid can't, Grace can't, and for Pritza it's just too far, right? Yeah, he can shoot like over there. Okay, Pritza. Just close the distance, please. And let's see who else we can use. Soul Keeper will go this way. Exo will also go that way. Just here. 
Yeah, that's fine. All right, jet some um, Nighthawk. Hmm. I think you should be fine. Over here, maybe. Rusty Pata Trower, that's it. All right, so you will be just using that. You'll also be used to scout. There he is. We shall try to shoot at him immediately and hit ourselves, of course. Of course, why not? That's much better. Now you need to come here and get healed. Okay, well that was really bad shooting over there. And that lock, that was re some really bad shooting. Fritz, I will go forward. That's alright. You have no time units left. Nighthawk is bleeding over there. We do have uh, Mr. Trower, who will try to breach from this side. And looks like we have a candidate there for a nice uh, shot from the distance. Can you do that, Craze? Not from this. distance but maybe from here yeah from here it will go okay stay there now Jetsam Jen will take her rifle back put that down and come closer Pater looks like you will be on the door opening duty and we may be able to come here and try two people going from that side. Oh, hello. Well, good night. Come closer. That's fine. Two and three. You are fine. You guys are okay. One there, one there. Anybody else can still move? Nighthawk can move. Tell me who this guy is. Just a soldier. That's fine. Rusty can go two steps back. Okay, actually, three steps back, but. Yeah, that's alright. That's all right. No activity, okay. Cool. How many hurt people do we have? I think we have two or three hurt people already, which is not that great, I have to say. So... 46 is enough for a, for a shot. We will also try to go here. First, before we open the door, there is no one there. Okay, in that case, you go up, try to find someone that looks like a job for Mr. Craze. Very good job, Mr. Craze. One here, one here, that's all right. And we have already opened the door, so now we shall prepare. First, you, you are a lightning rod and a scout. Looks good, 
all the rest of you will just hide behind all these nooks and crannies so that you don't get shot. This looks fine. And uh, you will need to go to the other side. And you may need to go help uh, up here. Actually not. Let's go help down there. And you will go help this way. And we may want to switch places. Not really. Next turn. Hello. Hello too. Alright. Well, that's great. Do we want them alive? We might. Dread some. Just find out who they are. A soldier. And... Uh, Nighthawk. A navigator. Not like we need too many of them. Not like we need too many of them. Let's take the navigator. Because... Being a navigator is cool. And let's kill that guy. Go back up. <laughs> and... Back up. Alright. There is one. Exo will shoot him in the head. Or not. That will do. Turn 8. First, go here. Open the door. One of you will go this way. There is nothing there. The other one will go the other way after you pick up your weapon. Go this way. Nothing there. Next. Nothing here. Do we have time for this? We do have time for this. If somebody shows up, we'll zap them. Nobody shows up, we'll go inside, but uh, that will have to wait a little bit for now. There is never anybody here. Looks like it. I was wrong. There is somebody there. Whoever you are, I don't need you. Goodbye. And that's it. Okay. Now we can start going back. What did you have actually? Pistol. Okay. This way? Nobody. Seems to be safe to advance. We will not send Exo, he already has a kill. We'll send Soul Keeper. Good job, Soul Keeper. Next turn. Okay, Pater will go first. He spots someone. Maybe you can shoot him. Oh, right. Hello there. <laughs> uh, okay, that's a soldier. Right. Freaking... Dang it. Why does that not work? die, move, and we'll need to block the elevator with the second guy as well. And uh, still quite a few people who don't have experience, but uh, for now I think I'm happy with the situation as is. You can come all the way back, check the back of the craft, same with you. that side. Nobody. So maybe I should send you
Hmm. Yeah, that's less than optimal. So first... Hey, how did I not see him before? How did... What? How did I not see him from here? <laughs> that's so ridiculous. Okay, I'm sure you can take a shot or two, right? 18. Yeah, take a shot. That didn't work, but we have uh, more where that came from. And it's not the end. Well, that is uh, quite bad, actually. I was expecting this to be the end. Now we have problems. Because Exo might get killed. And there might be somebody outside. No. No. Not here. Maybe on the other side of the craft. Maybe in the nooks and crannies. Who knows? But uh, now is the dangerous time. No. Interesting. Very interesting. Nighthawk, go back into the craft, you're hurt. Craze, ah. Oh. Keep your eyes open. Alright, good job. Squid. That's it. 13 aliens killed, 13 corpses recovered, 1 alive, a lot of stuff, 22 minutes. So we have enough time for another USO, another sub, but I think we have like 3 wounded people or so. Which is definitely not how I wanted this to go. Definitely not how I wanted yet. But only 2 days and 10 days, so that's, that's acceptable I guess. That's acceptable. Okay, so let's go and uh, see where they go next. So there is a 62, that's a large one as well. Uh, Triton 3, where are you? This guy. Select new target, right there. It will be night soon. And this one we should still be able to do during the day. There's something happening. Select, go here. Maybe we can do both of them during the day, if we're lucky. Maybe we can do this guy also with you, maybe. Yes, excellent. Triton 5, that's these guys. That's alright. That's all right. Let's give you these weapons first. And I think here I have also, yes, two snap rifle wielders. Let's uh, check it. It's in the middle and the turn. And we basically do the same thing as we did before. Check it out, there's two of them, go down, go inside. You will get out of the way and we shall do 54. One over here, you see both. So kill one. you 
kill the other, okay? Excellent. Good job, Gosu and uh, Shoreleave. Congratulations on your success. Let's go and check this corner out first. Yeah, that's the corner. No need to do anything more over there. Leroy, you can check this corner. It's not corner yet, but soon. So go check the corner. See, that's why we check all the corners. Because there are just people there, you know, where you never f expect them. Go down. And we need 52. That should be enough. We don't see them. But we see them enough. Go this way. And actually, you will also need to go that way. I think. Yeah, that's the reason why. Alright, so go down. And we have one last shooter. He should be able to... Kill somebody in the distance? Why not? Hmm. Okay, we are out of uh, these guys now. That's rather suboptimal. Because there's a problem here still. So what we can do is uh, some shots, but you guys can't really get out of the way anymore. But a nice aimed shot. Hmm. That's not enough to kill him, is it? Okay. Let's try once more. Sure. Good job, Pabst. I think what we'll have to do, dear Hal, we could throw an explosive, but it's a little bit too far. So what we shall do instead is throw a nice smoke. Right here. Excellent. Go back. And we can try also, we can try also this, dark price, prime that grenade and throw it right here, Ravsky will pick it up, Ravsky your throwing skill is 87, not that bad. Dark price, take that back, turn around. And Ravsky. Ravsky did not make it. Okay, I think we're fine, let's see. Well, somebody has moved there. <laughs> I think it might even have been our friend over here. Most likely. These guys are suiciders. Wow. Okay. This corner is fine. So, Leroy, Mr. P. Okay. Let's go this way too. Sounds good. Gordo sounds good. And now, one guy over there. They are mind shooting us, so let's start defending against that. We have killed what we could, but uh, we need to be able to defend ourselves if the worst happens. 
so I think you'll be just picking, dropping and picking up your weapons as you go. These guys don't need to do that, they, I mean, well, they can kill, of course, but uh, they have only projectile weapons, so they are not as dangerous as the ones with the explosives, I think. Maravsky, you're coming with us, and Dark Prize too. The girl sniper rifles. I'm not sure exactly. One will probably go there, pocket commando, and the other one will probably go on the same side, really. Somewhere over there. And turn this way, so that we have a nice view on everybody. Anybody wants to come closer to us? No, but they do mind control us, so it's good that we have uh, used uh, the drop and pick trick 20 it's all right come closer now these guys see someone that's a very nice shot for our sharpshooters right dear heil long shot and a very successful one Next one will be for Pocket Commando. Okay. Then uh, over here, turn around. Over here. That's fine. That's fine. Shore leave. Pick up your junk and come closer. And drop your junk. Same for Eddie. I think over here, can't drop anymore, my bad, mm, yeah, somewhere around here, drop it like it's hot, and over here, there, next, height, Right. Probably shouldn't be placing all of you all together. But so far so good. Next turn. So they are going after Gosu. Which is okay with me. I have nothing against that. Leroy? Okay, nobody on this side. There is somebody probably inside. Ooh, that's a very interesting spot to be. Can we lob a, a shot there? No, we can't. So we must be... Well, he has just a pistol. So let's not care about him too much. Go up and there's uh, one more who we can totally kill with shore leave. Right? Very much so. Good job, Shore Leave. Stay there. And we go up once more. And down once more. We also go over here. And don't see anyone, right? Stay there, Iris. Gordo, come closer. Shore Leave, good job. Eddie. Good old Eddie. We do have Mr. P over here. He will uh, prime that grenade and throw it like there. That might be enough. Who knows? Go down. Eddie, we shall prepare over here if everything else fails. Go down, face this way. Gosu, you will go here, put it down, Rice Lord, if we need to lob something there, we should be prepared over here, 
Next, false logic. You guys actually need to replenish a little bit of energy and still hide from that guy that is trying to get to us. That was just a pistol, so don't worry, okay? We are not hurt. Repeat after me, not hurt, right. Now the thing is, I have put that thingy there. So it would make sense that he moves. Because uh, I need to go through there and I don't want to kill myself, right? Alright. 39 time units. Looks like you can use it. Then uh, over here. More than fine. Short leave is good. Eddie is good. Gosu is good. Everybody else is good. Right. Next. Come on, I need this to be destroyed. Mm. Here, that should be very nice. And here, that should be nice too. Can't go there just yet, so what we shall do is check out all these things. Sounds like a plan. Alright, so we need to open that and find out if he has any time in its left. So, dark price. He does have some time in its left. Let's send him... Let's say hello. <laughs> he might decide to go the other way. In which case you will wait for him. And we wait for that guy to come out. I don't know what that was. Oh, that was... yeah, that was the proxy grenade, of course. Did it really destroy all this? I mean, it was so far away. What the heck? Well, I guess I shouldn't be using explosives inside of the craft. That's a good old saying in XCOM. Never use explosives inside. Okay. I'm sort of... Uh, I don't like this. I will need to use another explosive to trigger that explosive or something. That sucks. I could go from... Yeah, that's probably what we will do. Just go from the top. Okay, I think that's no longer an option. So... Let's take Eddie, 62, and tell him to shoot right there. Didn't work. So another option is something like this. Goodbye. Say hello to all your dead friends on your way to the heaven or to Aquatoid Hell or whatever you have on your home planet. This is fine. 
This is also fine. Let's go actually this way. And we spent 20 minutes here already. So I should uh, hurry up a little bit. They, I have blocked myself basically, my fault. We will try to do this a little bit better. So hello. One down and Gordo and Mr. P both don't have experience. Excellent, still not it though. So come up. Uh, you will come down as well. Block that. And maybe go down and back up. Turn around. Nothing here. Lero is back with us. Nobody there. Go get your weapon, Leroy. You need it. Maybe you'll need that as well. Go up one level and stay there. Aquatoy technician von Berserk somewhere where we don't see him. That's alright. Where we don't see him must be down here. I'm not sure if that's the one. But if he is... He's not gonna live to tell the tale to anyone else. Alright. Now that sucks a little bit. Won't lie, that does suck. Because I do not have any ranged weapons. Can't go through here because I have blocked myself. Okay. So Mr. P does not have any experience, but uh, he would be seen. There's even two more. Okay, that's pretty surprising. That should be enough. You are now in not such a great position come here next turn soldier panicked and something else okay so first take care of this soldier second care of this one 14 killed how many 21 minutes actually the same as last time very nice, stats all over the place, cannons, rifles, pistols, pulsers, stuff, 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 excellent. Now, who else? We have Triton number 3 and 4 and 2, okay, looks like, excellent, looks like we can maybe do another mission. That's a small one. Alright. Alright. I uh, don't actually need that. Yeah. Even through the small one we want to go quickly. Excellent. Yeah, looks like we will go straight for the craft. And uh, also straight for these guys, right? Excellent. Mr. Rock. 
Would you be so kind? You don't see him? I think that was a double kill. Must have been, right? Okay. Then uh, maybe somebody over in this direction. Cool. And somebody right there. Yeah, you stay there. And we shall disembark with these guys again. One, two, over here. And you need to go just there. More guys that will breach. We have too many people for such a small mission, I think. Anyone? Doesn't look like it. Okay, so Mr. Medic Nunez. There's four inside. Nothing we haven't seen before. Looks like that is fine. seems to be fine too so one on this side one on this side one over here one on the top that way okay and now let's bring in the cavalry one Two, three, four, and these guys can wait. Next turn. Hello. Good job. Just move a little bit, not too much. Don't want you to die. And we need to continue scouting. Seems all right. Seems legit. Fine, 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 fine. Good. Turn this way, actually. Good. And more scouting over here. Oh, it was just one. No, it was two guys. One and two. Double shot like that. Yes. Excellent. Next turn. More doors opening. We'll uh, have a quick look at them in just a moment. Medic Nunez sees everything. Come here. Put that away. Come here. Yeah, and come closer. Might be actually too close, but uh, it's not. Okay. So, Captain Swordfish and Medic Nunez. Well, Medic doesn't have experience, and Captain Swordfish, I think, has. Okay, Ataka. 
Buccaneer does not have experience. Good job, Buccaneer. There were three left, right? There is one more. Grand Cephibus, you will use all three shots. Excellent, go there. And I'm pretty sure there was someone over here. Yeah, there's actually two of them. Okay, something like this. Face this way. And this way, don't shoot at them. Or, nah, don't shoot at them. You may be in a little bit of danger, but let's see. No. No danger. So, Medic does not have experience. Let's open the door for him. Good job. Buccaneer, Captain Swordfish. Mm. Yataka does not have experience. Where is Yataka? He's far away. Doesn't matter really, just kill him. That's not it. It's not it. There's more. Interesting. Okay, that is unexpected. And we might have some serious problems now because they will be the last alien and uh, they will start seeing us. Hmm. They will probably also be somewhere where I don't expect them to be. So you will go down, somewhere over there, face this way, face this way, face that way. What the heck? Nobody there. Nobody there. Okay, who else? Mr. Neviem? Don't think that oh look at that little git look at that little git hiding over there like a git Wow Wow We have very good shot I mean how? Meh. 30. That was a miss as well. Okay, you know what? Let's uh, maybe do some shots with our uh, guys with uh, Gauss weapons. I mean, it's total waste of ammo, but um, why not? And you need to move closer too. Alrighty. He 
He's still hiding like the little git he is. John Diacono does not have experience. Well, that's not gonna help you. That is. Congratulations, people. Not so many experiences, actually, but uh, I'm okay with that. A lot of stuff, and we did three missions in one hour. Maybe we can do one more. Uh, is this going to be a night mission? No. So let's do this one as well. Four missions in one hour would be nice. Well, you have to have something, right? And the rest is fine. Good. Let's uh, end the turn immediately. up. Nice. That's exactly what we wanted to see. This is a corner. Need 60. One is right here. Excellent. And oops, need 60. Yep. Second is right here. Excellent. Good job, Shadow Lin and Domi. Congratulations. Now let's uh, scout some more. There's the UFO. And there's one guy who doesn't know how to behave and needs to be eliminated. Okay. 60. Let's see if you can shoot from here. You can, but uh, that's not the best option, I guess. Yeah, that's not the best option. Go up. Maybe you can find a few more. Or not. I will not bring anybody else. I don't think, at least. Or will I? Yeah, you see the same guy. I don't know if they st will start mind controlling me or not. I may wanna put Starring Poet's gun down. And maybe we can do some sharpshooting with these guys. So H2DO and, uh, and Shinobi over here. The rest will just uh, drop their weapons because they can. Don't want anybody to shoot at me. I mean, mind control me and shoot at myself. Doesn't seem to be the case. So, one looks good. Second. Looks good. Third. Looks good-ish. Do you think we can shoot through here? Well, we totally can. Good job, dummy. <laughs> you will prepare over here, Jono. And uh, Shadowlin as well. Okay. Now Chef Chambler comes closer. You will come closer. You will just face that way. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. You can go down. Fine. Fine, 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 fine. Good. Okay. Let's close the distance, take more people, one and two, yeah, like this, and three, maybe, too bad I don't have my diving gear, probably should start using the aqualung again. Yeah, that's, 
that's all right. Just go there. Cool. So, first things first. You go here and we'll open the door. Then this guy will run in. Excellent. Well, it didn't even hurt. Cool. We did it. Four missions in one hour. Yay. <laughs> a squad leader. We do have a squad leader already. Buy, sell. Okay. Who's next? That was four missions, so we have one more... One more guy ready. That will be Triton number three. You will go here, Triton number three. We have a heavy gauss report. The heavy gauss is cumbersome but extremely effective. It operates with a large particle accelerator and is virtually unstoppable. The anti-proton stream is confined inside a gallium arsenide shell that implodes on impact, releasing the antimatter. Antimatter. Well, now tell me how did Gauss weapon not work on uh, the lobster man if it operates on antimatter? I mean, antimatter eats up any matter. Also, lobster man matter, unless they are made of antimatter. So, that probably should be rewritten. I mean. <laughs> If anything releases antimatter, it destroys everything, no matter how much armor or, resi or resistance there is. Whatsoever. Anyway, 50 more people, let's do that heavy gauss clip as well. And uh, we'll manufacture those a little bit later. Let's uh, patrol with this guy and uh, what else can we do? Heavy Fermi glance over here. That's nice. Hmm. I don't know. I guess we just end the episode and uh, we'll continue next time. So, thank you very much for watching. See you next time. Bye bye.